Uh, hi guys, uh, this is my uh, Ducati Multistrada. Um, I'm going to just uh, run through uh, sat nav uh, mounting options. I think I've come up with a cheap uh, alternative to uh, various mounts and stuff that you can uh, purchase on the market. Um, one of which um, was one of these guys. Um, obviously it's uh, a case which uh, attaches to the handlebars um, obviously sat nav goes in zips up there's all this kind of backing in here which uh, sort of pads it out but I mean it's big it's bulky um, it's ugly um, and uh, it's pretty intrusive um, you know when you're on the bike you kind of find yourself sort of looking too much to the left it's sort of in your face um, as I say it's kind of semi-permanent um, attachment um, and uh yeah i don't uh i don't like it at all um and i mean as i say although it is detachable but uh i mean who's going to want to carry that uh, bulky thing around with them really um so i kind of got rid of that um and uh, what i come up with was uh, was this little fellow over here um yeah simply velcro um i done it on my previous uh, Duke, uh, and I found it. Uh, I found it works great, um, and there it is. Obviously, in an ideal position, um, I know that you can get these uh, these mounts. Um, I guess you'd kind of detach this, place it on, and you've got some sort of uh, ball mount um, affair, which uh, which I'd find pretty. Uh, Pretty ugly, really. Um, so all I've done was uh, just attach a bit of uh, Velcro to the stem here. Um, used a bit of an additional um, spray mount adhesive uh, just to make it that uh, that bit more secure. And uh, yeah, it's absolutely fine. As I say, bit of Velcro then on the back, and uh, just simply stick it on. Take some getting off. Um, it's not going to come off at high speed uh, and just as a added precaution um, against the elements although it is pretty much protected by the windshield but um, just as an added precaution I put some uh, silicon around the edges uh, here uh, just to give it a water seal but I mean we came back from uh, from Nicosia the other day and it absolutely pissed it down um, and it was fine uh, and again without it being in a in a case it's easy to use even with the gloves on I can uh, still operate it fine so uh, as for power supply well there are uh, a couple of uh, DIN sockets either side of this uh, machine but again uh, placement of them really isn't ideal for what I wanted uh, trailing wires running up the bike here uh, they're gonna be uh, gonna be in the way really um, so what I did was uh, I purchased a USB um, connection uh, port which uh, has got a couple of sockets there. That'll uh, obviously keep the sat nav charged and uh, be handy for charging up uh, phones etc. Uh, other little gizmos. Um, so that's quite uh, so that's quite handy. Wires are just sort of run through here, um, and there's a designated uh, power supply. Um, which is uh, for sat nav sort of installations as it happens um, there's a white uh, socket underneath this bit of uh, fairing here at the side and if I just kind of tilt you to the side a bit you might be able to view it that's it there um, just a white socket uh, there's a wire which is trailing from it which isn't really going anywhere uh, so you just need to cut that off um, put a couple of connectors on uh, and uh, that'll take it through the um, ignition system um, otherwise uh, connecting it direct to the battery is going to be on all the time of course um, and just uh, end up running your battery down so uh, so you need to put it through uh, the ignition uh, system uh, and at the same time that'll be uh, protected um, by a fuse um, but just as an added precaution I left the uh, fuse which came with the kit, uh, so it's got a, a double uh, sort of inline fuse, if you like. Um, so, uh, so yeah, that's about it, guys. Um, 
yeah, bit of Velcro. Um, as I say, suits my purposes. Looks pretty good. It's in line with everything. Cheap alternative. Um, bit of Velcro. What can I say? Job done. Cheers.